All right, welcome to another Notion tutorial. Today I'm going to be showing you how to connect your Slack to your Notion and your Notion to your Slack. Um, the way that this is helpful is that a lot of teams are already using Slack for team communication, so it can be great to get notifications when you are mentioned or added um, into a page or a comment in Notion. It will notify you in Slack. And then with Slack to Notion, you can also um, when someone sends you a task or something that you need to remember or add to your Notion, you can connect it so that you can send that to a specific database in your Notion. So first I'm going to get you um, get Slack, I mean Notion talking to Slack. So we're going to go to settings, we're going to go to my notifications, and we're going to just turn this on. We're going to pick the Slack account that we want to use, and then we're just going to go ahead and hit allow. All right, and now um, it will allow um, when you get, um, you will receive notifications to this in Slack when you're mentioned in a page, your database property, or in a comment. So that is how you connect your Slack to your Notion. Now to collect, connect your, that is how you connect your Notion to your Slack. Now to connect your Slack to your Notion, you're gonna go to connections. And then I already have me connected here, but I'm just gonna go ahead and disconnect. And then um, to add the connection, you would browse connection gallery. You would go here and hit Slack. And then you can go ahead and add to Notion. Make sure you just have the right one and then go ahead and hit allow. And we're gonna make sure we pick the right Notion account and then allow. Okay, so now um, you can see that I have connected this a couple of different times. Um, and the great thing about this is if there's something that I want to add to my, um, let's see, season two ideas. Say I wanna add this to my Notion database. I'm going to click the three little buttons, hit send to thing, and then I'm gonna put rooted, oh, let's see, podcast. Okay, publishing calendar. Um, and then what I can do is title this page, so season two, ideas. Um, you can also, if there's additional properties in here, um, we can just pick um, you know, what we want it to do. And then I can pick that I want this to be um, need to outline. And then if I wanted to add more properties, I could do that as well. So then I'm just gonna go ahead and hit save. And then that's gonna go and pop in into my season two ideas in Notion. So there you go, you can see. It is there now so that I don't forget it. This is also really great for when you're trying to send tasks. So a lot of times my clients will send me tasks in Notion. So I can just hit send to Notion, send to that master task database and voila, it is in there. And 